I've got uh, two of these windows. These are double hung windows. Um, I fixed one of them and I thought maybe I would film a video to how to fix these because this is a common problem I think, especially with cheaper windows. Uh, the, um, the balance mechanism in this particular case is stuck up on this one and it's, it's normal on this one. So the problem is, is when you go to open this up, you've got a lot of play in it and sometimes the mechanism gets stuck up here and you can't shut it. So what I need to do is, is take this whole thing apart, uh, take the balance mechanisms out, and you can see this balance mechanism is literally, it's like hanging up here. Actually, see that? So this thing's sitting up here, and it's, uh, it's not supposed to be like that. So what I need to do, there's a couple things I need to do. Uh, I need to take these, um, these spacers out, and those are the stops for the, the window. So take these out, put them there, just one on each side, and they're just compression fit, right? So they just friction fit in there. And now, these guys here, these little latches, well, they're pushed in now, but in order to help uh, do everything what you're going to want to do is, is pull the bottom out so you can uh, you can uh, essentially it's going to help put the mechanisms back in these mechanisms the balance mechanism so um, take a flathead screwdriver or your fingernail if you have uh, you know if you can do that it just pops right out and they're real easy However, this one, because it's kind of covered with the uh, balance mechanism. All right, so what I want to do is take this window out. In order to do that, I'm going to lift it up all the way and move it out. So I'm going to put this camera on a mount and hopefully it stays put. So this basically, we, we go like this, but... I need a screwdriver in order to do that. <clears throat> I don't think I can get this out without doing that. So I just pry it up um, rather than using my finger nail. Okay, so now as I push this up, it should help hold that up. Hopefully that will help hold those guys on there. But this one, I know this is free. Um, there should be a hook in, in a hole here. So if that hook is not in that hole, it's just going to slide down. So we'll definitely have to watch that. Um, obviously this is a tight fit. There we go. We got it. All right, so maybe, just maybe, um, having those latches out uh, to catch the, um, the balance mechanism. So you can see, let me see if I can show you this. See right there how it catches it? So it minimizes the upward travel of this and it holds it. And again, this thing should be in a, in a hook. So let's see if um, the hook is completely, you know, I'm gonna pull it down. Yeah, so this guy's in there. So you can see there's tension on it. And as I, as I let go, see how it lifts itself up? So that, that is the way it should be. This guy is not in there, I don't believe. Let's see. Maybe it is too. That looks like it's in there. So you see that hook? And it goes in the slot right there. 
So you just basically take that hook and you drop it in and it goes right into that slot and basically makes a little bit of a So now theoretically this would be able to pull down, but I don't know. I wonder if these things could be lubed possibly. I don't know, I lubed the other ones and it made them make a lot of noise. So I'm not sure if I want to lube these or not, but they may need lube. I'll have to check. see this mechanism. It's really hard to get the good lighting in here because the um, camera unfortunately is probably not capturing it. But if we pull the, the hook, yeah, see that's quiet. If I put lube on that, I think what it, it actually makes it louder. See if we can fix it without putting lube on. So this goes in here in the hook. And now if I push down, okay. So theoretically, that's where it should be. Okay, so just like this one, same thing goes. That makes noise too. These things just are nasty. You know, there's nothing good about these windows, to be honest. These are really cheap windows, but it's what we have. It's not like you can go change up all the windows in your house. That's a, that's a massive expense, and the builders, these new track homes, I mean, this is an O four or 05 home, but um, all the track homes, they use the worst, um, everything, the worst components pretty much that you can imagine. As long as they say double, or as long as they say um, low E coating, you know, they don't care. Um, everything else is pretty much by the wayside. Okay, so this thing should theoretically be fixed. But let's see, if I pull down, it should go down without having a problem. And it does. It should go up without having a problem. So that's good. So that looks like it's a fix. But the problem, I think, is these pieces, I believe, are too short. I think they should be longer, these blocks. So when you put them up here, I think it allows the, the uh, window to go too high. But I'm going to push these little stoppers back in, push that back up. So now if I lift up, yeah, that's perfect. Man, that's awesome. So this has been bugging me for, uh, I don't know, five years. Just not working very well at all, but this is great. And that didn't require anything but um, just taking it, resetting it, and um, putting it back together. Nothing was broken. So that's really great. Maybe somebody will find this video useful. I'm sure there's more people out there that need to find ways to fix their windows. So that's pretty much it. So these are really the important parts, those little clips right there that, that come out in order to stop the, uh, the balance mechanism. And when you put it in there, the, the, um, the spring is going to want to, you know, 
shoot it up and oh, well it'll basically just fall off you know as it goes up it'll just fall out this way so this keeps it engaged and then you got to remove these this is the trick if you don't remove these you can't really get the window out it's there's not enough room to clear the bottom so if you basically what's going to happen is you see those guys there well when you when you push it up higher these pop out of the bottom so when you when these pop out of the bottom and become invisible visible that allows you to pull this window out because right now those you can't you can't pull the window out because those are engaged in the side so it's making it so there's like a little a lip in there but when you take this out and you push it all the way up to where this basically hits here but you know that's where you need to do that um, you go above that little, this little guy right there, and then you can take the window out. So, yeah, I mean, like I said, this is as good as it gets for these windows. So, that's really great. Um, and this is my uh, mounting mechanism, by the way, for my camera. Uh, it's actually a, uh, um, a tool that I use for work all the time, and I just put some, you know, gym shorts uh, up there so it doesn't pull the paint off the ceiling when I uh, pull it off of the ceiling. Yeah. But these are indispensable and I've got a, of course, a mount that clips on there for my cameras. This is actually why I use this for lasers or putting plastic up on the, the ceilings. So it works really well. But anyways, so this is just a little, a little bathroom area. So uh, not a lot of room for tripods or anything, but this is great because it literally just goes up there and you can put it anywhere. All right, so that's it. Uh, hopefully somebody found this useful, I hope.